the utmost respect to this event. establishing a farmer training school and the CF and it has become a reality in two years. As per the request of farmers, the next step should be to develop this school according to international standards and to upgrade as the campus of the Plan University for Climate Change. Sri Lanka's diverse agricultural systems that suit various agroecological conditions offer significant advantages to improve resilience to climate impacts. The current debate over sustainable agriculture taking place in the country, providing some stimulating inputs for all. It suggests the necessity of the framework for sustainable intensification of the agriculture system to provide effective market-driven and eco-friendly solution for many problems. The Climate Smart Irrigated Agriculture Project in Sri Lanka is now very well positioned to stimulate the broader institutional change. With the present government, we now have a very strong and high level by for emphasizing innovation and push new technology applications including providing real-time agriculture, meteorological information to farmers and other stakeholders. In the next four to five years, we should be able to effectively demonstrate these approaches in increased market integration mobilizing private investment, technology and innovation in as climate resilience, inclusive growth and increased export earnings. Before I conclude, I wish to thank the World Bank for their agenda of elevating our team uh, deliverable plan. My best wishes to the future of this farmer training school which will contribute in towards rural transformation, entrepreneurship development and food security in Sri Lanka. We look forward to your continued support and engagement to ensure prosperity in Sri Lanka. Thank you. Climate change is one of the major environment problems that uh, the world community faces today.
What is very encouraging to see as well is that some of the technologies that are being used are not that complicated, but they're really smart. And they even build on traditional practices, allowing us to go back and thank the wisdom before us. So again, the World Bank is so pleased to be able to be part of this project. I've heard that we have to cut some financing. I hope Martin, Paris, Gio, we can continue to support this project, maybe augment it a bit to make sure that anything that has been lost can be added. You also don't seem to have lost too much time. There was the time when implementation got a bit slower, but then it got quicker again. And I encourage you to keep going because the project is changing lives and creating sustainability. So thank you so very much.